so hey my tourists my boo gang <laughs> i am sorry that i'm not i haven't been back as soon as i said that i would um i've been tied up with my business you guys are, some of you don't know my entrepreneur um and valentine's day is super busy for me because i bake so everybody needs strawberries and sweet stuff for their sweetheart so i've been dealing with that and i still have a lot of work to do so um forgive me <laughs> uh charge it to my heart but um what's i gonna say let's get started so i'm gonna do a love reading for the zodiac sign of taurus um for those of you that don't know my name is deja i do not read reversals so i'll be reading upright and then let's see now i like to start my readings off with a prayer so divine holy spirit i ask that you please send your angels to stand guard guide and protect me as I open this reading, Divine Holy Spirit, I ask that you please close any door in or any portal that is not of you. I ask that you guide me through so that my reading can be truthful, honest, and accurate for their highest good. Amen. Okay. So let's see what's going on with my zodiac sign of Taurus. Uh, reading upright. Let's see. First, I'm going to start by pulling some energy how you're feeling my holy spirit reading up right how are my Taurus is feeling coming out oh i feel like being alone <laughs> Terrified of hermit spirit. Terrified of hermit. oh yeah you're definitely so you could be moving away from something someone uh isolating yourself going you could be on a spiritual journey too um going within meditating uh, just trying to move away to calm my waters. I don't know what happened. Let's see. How is my Taurus feeling in the past? What was their past energy? Okay, so this could be about a relationship, a partnership. So in the past, you were feeling this Two of Cups energy that's like coming together. You could have been coming together with someone. Um, but it's like now you're in this hermit mode. You want to isolate yourself, especially with the Six of Swords move and Six of Swords move away to calmer waters i don't know if there was a falling out a disagreement or what happened but you just feel like being alone right now um pull up. yeah page one's came out let's see spirit can you tell me more about how my tourists are feeling why do they feel like isolating themselves or being alone could be feeling like starting something new could be working on something new it could be a new investment new project new relationship um uh, but definitely feel like focusing on new with this ace of uh pentacles coming out hmm could be wanting to start something new invest in something from your past because as quick as i said that with the ace of pentacles coming out that's like a new investment new project six of cups came out and this is like nostalgic um nostalgic memories someone from your past past relationship so you could be planning to start something new or invest into something from your past that's the energy i'm feeling right now oh yeah because you could feel like you could feel um a loss guilt regret I don't know the five of cups at the bottom of the deck let's see let's see let's pull more tell me more tell me more about this hermit why are... well no yep there was a falling out there was a fight with the five of swords clarify the five of swords fight about what oh oh wow Oh, yeah, definitely a fight with the Knight of Swords, some type of, it could have been harsh words said. Um, and the Three of Pentacles, I don't know why that all came out. I'm going to put these back because I didn't want this many clarifiers, but I pretty much understand what that's about. Looks like there was some type of falling out, some type of disagreement. It could have been some harsh words that were said. Um, somebody, I'm hearing cocky, arrogant. Maybe someone came off cocky, arrogant, harsh in this communication with this king of wands. He could be narcissistic too. 
that people use that word so loosely nowadays. I hate it. Yeah, there was an ending. This falling out could have led to an ending. So it's like now you're wanting to start something new or invest in something from your past. Um, moving away. Moving away. Okay, let's see. Tell me more about this Six of Cups, Ace of Pentacles. Can you clarify this energy spirit? Oh, <laughs> these cards are coming out, Taurus. So, yeah, it's like you're making plans. You could be planning on revisiting. Let me see. Something from... Oh, yeah, you're planning on moving forward from something after some type of falling out. Clarify the Six of Cups. Clarify this. Hold on. Clarify the Six of Cups. There you go. Take them out. Yep. Seven of Pentacles and Six of Cups. Let me see. Seven of Pentacles. Clarify the Seven of Pentacles. Yep, yeah, that's what I thought. It's you're wanting to invest in something from your past, Taurus. Something, someone, some type of situation. You're wanting to give to this now. The six of um pentacles. It's like give. I don't know. I'm hearing that you want to give to something, someone from your past. Tell me more about this six of pentacles. Six of Cups. Yeah, because you feel a loss and regret. And remember earlier, remember earlier when I um, was first pulling, this was at the bottom of the deck, and I was like, because you could be feeling a loss, regret, sorrow. Well, it came out. <laughs> um, it could have been a loss, could be feeling regret, guilt. This could be you or your person. Flip it, whatever. Flip the roles if necessary. This is a love reading, though. So, definitely a love situation, especially with this Two of Cups and all these cups. But, um, yeah, because you're feeling a loss and regret and sorrow over something, some past situation. Maybe you could be thinking of memories from your past with this Six of Cups. And there was a shakeup in the foundation. This tower card. Tell me more about the tower. Okay. Here it goes. Here on one sided. Maybe things were once one side, and then these aces are coming out again. There definitely definitely could be a reunion. Oh wow, look at the bottom of the deck we got the ace of wands at the bottom ace of pentacles ace of cups this could be a fresh start normally i would say that this would be something new but with that six of cups seven of pentacles and five of um cups coming out this is something from the past so this could be like a reunion um restart after some type of ending some type of falling out and then why does why did this ten of um wands come out spirit can you tell me about the ten of wands when this king was feeling burdened King was feeling burned. And tell me more about this Ten of Wands. This King of Swords, Ten of Wands. Yeah. Feeling burdened. Holding on to something. An idea. Something. Someone. Tell me more. So this back. Um, let's see. I'll leave that out. Let me clarify this two of cups too. Let me clarify this two of cups up here, spirit. 
Yep. What did I say? It's the same. It's the same things. Oh, and then there's heartbreak. This is the same things coming out, Taurus. So yeah, you're definitely feeling like being alone, going into hermit mode, isolating yourself, going within, um, moving away to calmer waters. I'm hearing just going within. You need some time to reflect and think. Um, after trying to come together in some sort of situation. But it looked like things didn't work out. You or someone could have been left in the cold. And it's like now you or someone are thinking of reinvesting into something, someone from the past. Which is going to, in the end, leave someone heartbroken with this Three of Swords. It could be this Queen of Pentacles. Queen of Pentacles... I'm hearing a mother. It could be a mother. Let me see. And then I got the Eight of Wands, Eight of Swords. So you could be thinking about communicating with someone, not knowing how to go about it, feeling stuck. Okay, I got this Eight of Swords. Not having to go about, not knowing how to go about. Oh, shoot. <laughs> The same, Taurus, why are the same cards falling out? This is literally the exact same cards. You are in your head. You or someone are in your head about communicating with this Eight of Wands, but it's like you're in your head. You feel it stuck. And this is weighing heavy on you. And you're trying to think logically with this King of Swords and Emperor. You're trying to think logically. <sighs> And look what's at the bottom again. Three of Swords and oh wow. Queen of Pentacles again. Same card source. Um, let's see. Where are we at? 12 minutes. I'm about to wrap this up. Well, let's see. Let's see how your person is feeling. Because I'm trying not to have super extra long readings. If you want an extended, you can email me. Or if you want the extended or a personal, you can email me. My email is in the description. Let's see. How is Taurus's person feeling? Divine Holy Spirit reading upright. How is Taurus's? Oh, too many. Too, way too many. How is Taurus's person feeling? Divine Holy Okay, yeah. You flew out. Same as you. Trying to think logically about the situation. They miss you. They miss you, but they're trying to think logically. They feel, they too feel, you two are mirroring each other. What the heck? They too feel, they also feel um, stuck. They feel stuck. They don't know what to do and this is weighing heavy on them also. Oh wow, and the star card at the bottom. So it's like you two are mirroring each other. <laughs> it came out well. <laughs> um, it's like you two are each other's wish fulfillment. But there's a lot of like rigid, stubborn, stuck energy and it's weighing really heavy on you and your person. Because I pulled this for both of you guys, but the Six of Cups came out for both of you. So you both, um, you both are mirroring each other. You both miss each other. So I don't know. Let's see what's going to be the outcome in this situation, Spirit. What will the outcome be? Looks like there will be balance brought back into a temperance. Either you or you and your person, you or your person's going to heal, or the you may heal, work on healing the situation. Tell me more about it. Um, Knight of Swords. That's that bold energy. Let's see. Tell me about this Knight of Swords. Someone rushing in. Someone rushing in. Somebody could be angry. <laughs> the Devil card came out. Somebody could be pissed. Yeah, they could be pissing. And um, I'm clairvoyant. I'm hearing in the song where he's saying, trying hard. I've been trying hard to breathe. Somebody could be pissed. And this is weighing heavy on them. And then the Queen of Pentacles finally came out. Tell me more about this um, devil card. Somebody could be obsessing. This could be drinking a lot, too. Yeah, somebody could be drinking a lot. The Hierophant. Two more cards. 
And I'm just hearing over and over again, thinking of this over and over again. This could have been on and off. An on and off situation. Um, tell me more, Spirit. What will the outcome be between Taurus and their person, Spirit? Aww. There will be a reunion. You two will come together. So you two will reunite with this temperance and the Ten of Cups. Um, be careful with this devil energy, though, because I'm also getting that this can be addictions. I don't know. Maybe you or your person could be drinking, smoking, doing too much of something or obsessing over the situation too much. Um, yeah, be mindful with that energy, Taurus. And that's all I have for you. Look what came out again. Yes, yeah, so somebody's feeling guilty and regretful. But there will be a reunion of coming together with this temperance and that Ten of Cups. Could be dealing with an earth sign, another earth sign. And be mindful of this devil energy, like I said. Someone could be upset, angry, or rushing in soon, boldly. Um, this could have been, a, like I said, again, an on and off type of situation. And then um, it's leaving you both feeling heavy, feeling trapped. And undecided, but you both are mirroring each other. You both do miss each other. Um, this is a wish fulfillment for you both. But you're trying to think logically, Taurus. And that is all I have for you. I'm going to wrap this up. We are at 16 minutes. So, um, I hope that was good. <laughs> I hope you all... I hope this resonated. If not, um, I understand. Check your other placements. I will be dropping Gem Gemini, Aries, and I'm going to try to get Cancer out. Um, but good night.